Modern drones come in many varieties, including attack drones, reconnaissance drones, and even kamikaze drones, all of which have proven highly effective on the battlefield. To make better use of this technology, the United States has developed a new type of unmanned aerial refueling aircraft in recent years, known as the MQ-25 Stingray. The U.S. Navy began working on a next-generation, carrier-based unmanned refueling aircraft back in 2006 initially aiming to create a stealth strike vehicle capable of penetrating enemy defenses. After much debate, in February 2016, the military shifted gears, deciding to refocus the program on a carrier-based unmanned refueling aircraft, with some reconnaissance, communication relay, and strike capabilities. This kicked off an official bidding process. After a lengthy evaluation, Boeing's proposal was selected as the lowest risk option. By July of that year, the project was officially designated the MQ-25A, with its development narrowed down primarily to aerial refueling. Before the MQ-25, over 20% of the Navy's Super Hornet fleet was dedicated solely to air-to-air -air refueling missions. The deployment of the MQ-25 promises to significantly lighten that load. On August 30, 2018, the Navy signed a contract with Boeing for four MQ-25 drones, valued at roughly $800 million. This aircraft is designed to serve as a refueling platform for the Navy's F-A-18 and F-35 carrier-based fighters, rather than taking on an attack role like the earlier X-47B, 